run. August. Oh my god. I'm such a huge Alien fan. Such a huge Alien fan. Um, Alien is one of my favourite movies of all time. No loads of people think Aliens is the best. No, you're wrong. Alien is the best. Okay. Uh, I cannot wait for this. Um, Freddy Alvarez is a... I think he's a good director. Um, I recently watched Evil Dead... His Evil Dead and really enjoyed it. Uh, the horror, the cinematography, um, the direction, pretty good. Um, Don't Breathe wasn't as good as Evil Dead, but still a decent movie. Didn't like the sequel uh, to that, but anyway, yeah. Um, this is good. It looks back. It looks like an alien movie. It does, um, because I think Covenant. It didn't feel like an alien movie, even though it had aliens in it but it didn't feel like a wow because aliens and alien they were good movies because they felt claustrophobic in a way and that added to the movies you know i mean aliens is not as claustrophobic as the first movie but it's still still a restrictive setting you know they're trapped you know in many respects um and Covenant and Prometheus, first of all, Prometheus didn't even have a xenomorph in it, I remember, until the end, but it didn't really look like a xenomorph. Um, Covenant, I thought, was a good movie, but again, like I said, it doesn't feel like a an alien movie, um, even though it was directed by Ridley Scott. Um, so yeah, uh, this looks good. Cannot wait. Uh, I recognise through the actors. Um... And I, I think I heard Giancarlo Esposito. I'm probably wrong, but I did hear his voice. Uh, one of the, I think the lead actress was from a TV show called Devs. Um, it's on Disney Plus in the UK. If you watch it, it's pretty good. Alex Garland did it. He directed um, Ex Machina, Annihilation. Also two good movies. Um, and Ridley Scott is producing this. So that might be a good thing or a bad thing, depending on where you sit on covenant and prometheus um yeah this looks like it's back to its roots um you know sci-fi horror in a fucking spaceship you know and i hear this is set between the first one and the second one which is good and hey we might see amanda ripley you know because i really hope they because Ripley's daughter is alive. Because in the second one, when they say Ripley awake, they show her a photo and they say, oh, your, your daughter has died. She was 60. So between that time, her daughter's alive. Right? So maybe she'll make an appearance at the end. Or maybe they'll do like a sequel with her. Because that'd be pretty cool. That'd be pretty cool. But anyway, let me know what you guys thinks. Thinks? Think. Uh, cannot wait for this. This is on one of my most anticipated movies of the year. Uh, just cannot wait. Cannot wait. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.